What's up, Caps Ninja? Sensei Lance here again today. Now, today I want to talk about something a little different. I want to talk about uh, practice and application. One thing that I highly encourage, um, whenever you, you see our videos, we discuss a lot of techniques to defend yourself against bullies, uh, abduction attempts, people trying to kidnap you, uh, just people trying to attack you, uh, things like that. Whenever you're doing some kind of self-defense training, it is not good enough to just watch the videos. You have to practice. Okay, so make sure, first of all, I love the idea of, of you watching the videos and, and practicing the techniques at home, either in the air, in your yard, or uh, uh, on a punching bag, or with a, with, a, with a responsible adult, all right? I think those are fantastic things to do. But I also encourage young people, really any people, to train to go to a local martial arts school. There's all kinds of great martial arts out there that have lots of self-defense qualities and fitness qualities that can help you save your life in a, uh, in a self-defense situation. Um, and I highly encourage you, check those out. There's a, there's a lot of uh, different kinds of schools out there, whether it be karate, Taekwondo, boxing, kickboxing, uh, Muay Thai, kickboxing, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, Judo. Even uh, if, if your local school has a wrestling program, wrestling is a fantastic style for self defense. It, it can really save you in a lot of self defense situations. So that's another thing I, that I highly encourage. Don't just watch the videos and practice at home, all right? In order for this stuff to work for you the most efficiently, the most effectively, I honestly believe that you need to go to a local martial arts school uh, or a local training facility, a fitness gym where they may maybe offer self-defense classes and train with other people that are trying to train in self-defense also. Don't just rely on training by yourself at home. Okay, I, I highly, I, I believe wholeheartedly in supporting your local martial arts schools, going there. Uh, of course, check out the YouTube videos. I think we put out some great content. There's a lot of people on, on YouTube and the internet that put out great content, but just watching the content is not good enough. You, you have to practice that or else those skills are not gonna be there for you when you need them. So I highly encourage you to please don't just watch the videos. Please watch the videos. Like and subscribe, please. But I also highly encourage you to go to your local martial arts school, whatever that might be. And remember, don't just pick the first one either. Try several of them before you make your choice because different styles offer different things. And you might not care for some, uh, some aspects of it and care for some other aspects of it, okay? So make sure that you try different martial arts schools before you make your choice and say, all right, this is the one I want to do. I think this is the one that's going to help me the most for my self-defense and my fitness goals. All right, y'all go out, show support for your local martial arts school. And, uh, let's, let's work on, on getting these skills sharp and, and getting them ready for the real world out there. Because remember, if you don't practice them, if you don't practice the skills that you need, those skills will not be there when you need them. So make sure to practice, study hard, and do your best. All right, ninjas, have a great day.